Farm Guy here with a new mod test for Farming Simulator 22. This is for all platforms, PC, Mac, and console. I'm on PS5 here on Rock Crawl for this test, and this is the Wilson 53-foot Super Hopper by Venom Mods. 21.12 megabytes to download. It is 10 slots on console. This is a very interesting and intriguing mod. I must do say so. However, there is one small issue that we will discuss in a moment. But first, let's find it under Tools and Trailers. And whoops, here it is. Uh, based on the uh, base game type Wilson trailer here, the Load King. Oh, that's a Load King. Uh, so this is a Wilson trailer, not the same thing as a Load King. Wilson, 53-foot Super Hopper, $83,000. And yes, that number is correct down at the bottom, 500,000 liters. So 40,000 up to 500,000 liters of all bulk products, including grapes. Yes, grapes. All right, have, let's have a look at it. There are several options. Uh... We'll start with tire brands Continental, Lizard, and Nokian. In Continental, we have the Plantation Duels and the Continental Stock Duels. We have Continental Stock HDD Duels. And uh, so there, no charge for the tire options. Lizard, uh, Super Duty, we have, yes, we have a few choices there. No charge for those. Nokian, Ground King, or Ground King Super Singles. Nice, no charge for any of those options. So yes, whatever tire you want, no charge. I love no charge. Toolboxes, no or yes, $850 for that toolbox. Mud flaps, you get standard, like so. You get uh, center, front, or all for 200 bucks. Special edition, this is where it gets interesting. Uh, you get the plain one, like so, if you like that. You get you can get a John Deere decal on the side, a Case IH, Eggco, Kloss, or New. So those are really neat. We're gonna leave it at No because we do have some color options and I want that to be visible at, um, at, at most. Attaches no or a rear hitch. Rear hitch, yes, please. Now, capacity, standard at 40,000 liters. This is a dual hopper trailer, by the way. Two hoppers, so 20,000 liters in each hopper. We have upgraded at 77,000 point, 77.6,000 for both. Uh, what that splits up into is uh, 38,750 in each hopper. Or you get the Unreal at 500,000 liters at 250,000 liters per hopper. Now that is something special. Um, no charge for any of the optional sizes, so that's pretty unreal. Uh, colors for the hopper. We get a bunch of awesome uh, special colors. Let's go with uh, green. Nice. Uh, now there's also um, of each of those colors you have aged you have a olive gloss sand sand gloss hmm, what's the difference um, new age or aged uh, frame let's uh, let's pick something bright orange and the cover color Let's go with blue and then rim colors. Uh, we have uh, the specialty colors up here, like uh, what's that? Copper Affection, Chrome Blackout. And then uh, we have, uh, we can even put in some uh, Giants palette of colors. No charge for any of the color changes. So if we go back up here, just so you can see it, the uh, specialty edition decals go there and so the color of the trailer is still the same just the decal or decal covers uh, the part where it's well stuck on 
Right, so even with all those options, which aren't, all, well, a lot of options, but not a lot of cost, $1,800, $84,800 for that trailer. Very nice. Right, so let's hop in. And I have this filled with rocks. And as you can see, no problems with the, uh, the trailer handling 40,000 liters of rocks at all. We have cover L1 and left on the trigger to open and close that cover like so we have tip side front and back that is the hoppers so the front hopper and the rear hopper you select it like so and that's really it for options it's really nice we get lights signals uh oh uh oh did i see a did i see a little bit of a oops with the tire going Oink. did it not like the weight of those rocks hmm that was a bit odd. I thought I'd seen it go give a little bit of a... Hmm. Mm, seems to be okay, though. It, it, it was fine driving over here, so... Um, no beacons or anything, just the lights. A nice running lights on the sides and everything. It's uh, pretty nice as far as that goes. So, unloading. This is the 40,000 liters. It is the actual weight, or well... It represents the actual weight of what these stones would weigh. Uh, there we go, unloading the front tank. Fairly, a, a nice speed, I would say, for 20,000 liters. It's not, uh, it's not too bad. And uh, then we R1 and down on the D-pad, and we got our rear tank, like so. Right. Now, now we get to the Unreal Capacity. This is where there's a bit of an issue, I must say. Now, as you can see over here, this is a standard base game dolly. It uh, quite readily hooks to the back of this trailer. So if you want to link them, uh, uh, several of them, or another trailer for that matter, to, uh, together with each other, um, you can do so now Here we have 250,000 liters of rocks and 250,000 liters of um, Wheat in this and uh, again, I've uh, tricked it up with some case decals and other things and We're going to unload this front hopper and No trouble coming up to this trigger this trigger tip side front we should, there we go. Now, um, here is the problem. Uh, let's start unloading. And there we go. As you notice, unfortunately, the unloading speed is a bit slow for the 250,000 liter capacity, where it was all right for 20,000 liters. You're going to be here a bit of a while um, unloading the 250,000 liter capacity. So it's a bit of a downer, uh, to be quite honest. Um, it's not game breaking or anything like that. It still affords you the opportunity to carry two kinds of product uh, at a massive capacity. You just have to be ready to sit here for a bit and wait for it to unload um, so if i were to ask for anything uh, any kind of improvement to this um, my wish list would be increasing the unload speed although i know it might affect the unload speed of the realistic version it would be a great benefit to those of us who like using the unrealistic versions also on a wish list if i had one for this uh, having the option to have one hopper at 500,000 um, instead of two at 250 each. That's just being a little bit nitpicky, actually. So, um, but overall, it's fantastic. Uh, very nice. I like the options for the uh, decals or no decals, if you like. Uh, what's uh, the no charge for all the options, pretty much. 
except for a few of the accessories that's very welcome and the the trailer hitch of course is always welcome to be able to attach things again and so you see it's almost an unloading while I've been talking here so it is it is quite a long time to wait to unload all that um, other than that I want to thank Viper Mo or Venom Mods. Sorry, Viper. Why did I say Viper? Venom Mods is the modder. I do believe this is going to be his. Uh, oh, his his second mod for all platforms. Yes. Uh, first trailer, and uh, very nice job. Um, very nice. Very nice job. Um, and that's the Wilson 53 foot super hopper by Venom Mods 21.12 megabytes to download and 10 slots on console. Thank you all for watching. I'm Looney Farm Guy, and remember, it's only a game, so till next time, bye for now.